Hello everyone, welcome to my vlog. Today is Tuesday. Uh, eh, normal Tuesday at work, you know, nothing fancy happened or nothing. Uh, got my equipment in, blah, 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 blah. Uh, normal work day. Uh, I did hear a few cool things today. One, Def Leppard and Poison are going to be in town along with, uh, not at the same time, but over the summer with uh, Motley Crue and Kiss are also going to be in town. Um, I think it's kind of awesome. If I was into going to you know concerts and stuff, I'd be all over that. Uh, all great bands, you know, uh, cool music, you know, and it, it would be fun. But I'm not really into going to concerts. Uh, the only concert. I want to go to or have been to and will continue going when they're in Nashville or in surrounding areas is Pearl Jam. That's my favorite band. So, uh, but uh, that's a, uh, you know, neither here nor there. I'm just not a concert goer. I just, that many people around, you know, it's just uh, like a recipe for something really bad to happen. And, uh, you know, I just, not a very big crowd person, you know. Um, but other than that, you know, you know, concerts are, are cool, but I just, you know, I went to all the ones I wanted to when I was growing up, and the only one I, I will go to anymore is a Pearl Jam concert, but um, enough on that. I uh, saw some exciting news today that, uh, excuse me, that uh, there's potentially, they have found a cure for cancer. Uh, they're going into human trials with it. Uh, so, uh, fingers crossed, you know, that's, uh, one of my big things that, you know, cancer research and, you know, especially with St. Jude's and everything, um, uh, you know, that's quite possibly the best charity out there, St. Jude's, uh, you know, I wholeheartedly believe that, you know, uh, people involved with that are, you know, very good people and uh you know they got the priority straight as a uh charity you know they uh for those of y'all that don't know st jude's is a children's hospital who uh specializes in cancer treatment for kids and um you know they never turn away a family but uh for their inability to pay you know so uh it's 100 percent donations you know they are not you know, federally funded or nothing, and it's it's an amazing charity, and for them, you know, for there to potentially be a cure for cancer, that's amazing. Um, for those of y'all that don't know, uh, five, six years ago, uh, six years ago, my mother passed away from, uh, she had cancer, and, uh, you know, it's a, it's a horrible disease that, you know, watching uh, somebody you care about just deteriorate, you know, and, uh, nothing, no one, there's nothing you can do for, her, you know, or them, and, uh, you know, to know that there is potentially a cure, that's outstanding, um, it made my day, actually, uh, my day was going pretty, you know, normally crappy on a Tuesday, but that brightened my day up hearing that, I was so excited to hear that. And, uh, hopefully it's not some, you know, internet prank thing, because that's messed up, you know, uh, so, I'm, fingers crossed, I'm hoping it's true, and, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited about it, um, for those of you out there who have lost someone to cancer, you know what I mean, uh, it's a very, you know, it, like I said, it, you watch someone waste away, you know, a healthy person and what just waste away because of some, you know, little cancerous organism, you know, uh, but yeah, I was, uh, very happy to hear that, and, uh, not much else going on today, I mean, I'm gonna go home, jump in the shower, and defunk myself, and, uh, as of right now, there's nothing re else really to talk about, um, if anything interesting happens, I'll turn the camera back on, let you guys see it like always, and if not, 
this will be the last you see me till tomorrow. So uh, have a good one, everybody.